at her. We are not gonna put her on the card like that. You think? <laughs> guys, what's up? It's your girl Kyra Sean. Welcome back to my channel. And your girl is excited. Why? Because it is another sip and slay. <laughs> Today's video is brought to you by Ebony Line. They were kind of sending me another unit to review for you guys. But as always, before we get into all the specs of this unit and what I think about it, share out the pack. Make sure if you're new to the channel, you go ahead and subscribe and smash that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. Also, give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this in the future. Let's go. Kenny got your girl this the other day. Go ahead and trip, 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 trip. Mmm, yum. Let me chill. Let me chill. Ooh. Ooh, goodness. Okay, so like I said, this unit was sent to us from Ebony Line. It's by Zuri Sis. It's the unit Fab. This is what her cards look like. I got her in the color 1B, and this unit does retail for, get ready, $29.95. Did I get that right? Did I get that right, sis? <laughs> Oh, we love a budget at this time. Cha-ching. This unit also comes in some sombre colors, so if you want to get that, you can. That'll be $2 extra. This unit does come with lace from ear to ear, as well as two combs in the front, one comb in the back, and the adjustable straps. It also comes with the moon part, so that is a part all the way around the crown right here. So no matter how you like your parting spaces, you can part on the left or right. I'd like my right side part. You can also do like a little half up, half down. They consider it to be natural. It's not really natural, but you, you know what I'm saying, okay? It also comes with baby hairs. You do not have to use those. I would say this unit is between Big Head Associate and Big Head Friendly. It does come down pretty much on top of my ear, but there's a little there's a little space in there, and I did have to go in and unhook the adjustable straps because the way it was with the straps hooked, it was a little bit too tight. I don't like my temples pulsating. Let them loose. I do have on my wig grip, and my hair is still cornrowed flat flat under this unit, so make sure your hair is properly maintained under your unit as far as the flatness, because you want to make sure you get the best fit out of your wig as possible. Okay, Almond? <laughs> Let me get a little sip. Mm. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's good. Thanks, Kenny. Now, this is a high heat Remy fiber, and I will tell you, she does bring the heat around the neck area. It's definitely giving off that yakky heat, okay? So the yak yak is in the building. Am I sweating? Do y'all see the sweat? <laughs> Good lord. She is heat safe up to about 400 degrees. I did use heat on this unit as you saw on the put down, mainly on the top, because the way that top knot is sitting, when you put it on your head, it's sitting pretty high. It's not natural looking, okay? It's not natural looking. It does come with a lot of volume up in here. Hot comb would have took too much time trying to flatten that out, so I did use the um, blow dryer on high heat initially, and then I went in and pressed through the hair towards the back with my hot comb to kind of relax that curl, because it was like a little bump in there. I also went in with some concealer into my parting space and some powder and concealer around the hairline and then I went in you know did my little thing with my baby hairs and that is it for this unit you guys nothing crazy going on oh I got a little flatness let me get that let me get that this is a very easy unit to make my own. Now, I will say, on her stock card, I like how they actually have this little middle braid here. I don't think that looks bad at all, but the way that it comes out the pack, they don't even have her style the way they had her style on, out the pack on her cards. Normally, you see it on the cards, so they have it kind of here. They just on the top of the head. They, they knew what they was doing. They knew that style was some trash. <laughs> they knew better. We not gonna put her on the card like that. You think? <laughs> Like her side part looks a little bit more natural than mine so when you have a straight back part like this it doesn't look as natural so the trick is to kind of you know maneuver the wig a little bit like shift it to the side to kind of make the part a little more you know angled so that you can give more of a natural look this is how long the unit is on me at five six it comes down just you know at my chest and then to the back that is how she falls so she falls pretty much mid back for me i got a few snacks with this unit but not a lot but i did get shedding with this unit i think most of that came from when i was trying to see if i could 
fucked the hairline up a little bit and I was kind of just like, it ain't worth it because as I'm pulling on the hair now, I'm not getting any shedding. So just be mindful of that. You may get some shedding with this unit or you may not get any at all. I just tried her sister wig, Kenzie, not too long ago. That was the 99J wig. And I know I did have some comments um, from a couple people as far as the styling of that video because some people were just basically trying to tell me that that wasn't the same wig and I was just kind of like, did you watch the video? I mean, I showed you the styling. I showed you how it looked out the pack. I showed you how I took the braid out and everything and you still won't question me? <laughs> I don't care if it's $30 or $300. I gotta style the wig for me, okay? Out the pack, ready to go, that'll be nice, but it doesn't always come like that. And I don't always like the styles that it comes in, clearly, no. That's why I showed you guys like the packaging. I showed you guys me taking the wig out the packaging. I showed you the cards, showed you everything. It's the same wig. Take a sip, take a sip. <laughs> that curl is very very pretty y'all I really like the unit this is how it looks on this side so obviously you do get the lace on this side the hairline is not natural at all so you may want to go in and put this a little bit behind your hairline and kind of bring your edges out if you have them to bring out if you don't this is just showing you how you can kind of you know slick the unit down and behind your ear to make it you know a little bit more wearable out in public I personally would not glue this unit down to my head because you don't really get that much lace to do that and I don't really see the point in doing that you do you Claudine okay you do you I'm not complaining this is an older unit I think this came out in 2018 so I'm not mad at it I really love the romantic you know style of this unit the curl of it you know the long swoop bang here like I just I really like it I like it a lot <laughs> The luster, I feel like it's very natural, but I did go in with my Garnier Free Tea Sleek and Shine just a little bit, and I, you know, put it through my hands and worked it through the hair. Like, this is giving me all types of, like, spring, summer vibe. Kenny, we cooking out this weekend? I, I need me some burgers and some potato salads, some deviled eggs. Ooh, I'm hungry. Oh, snack time. Thank you. <laughs> But that is all I got for you guys today. Shout out one more time to Ebony Line for sending me this unit. I really appreciate it. The direct link for this unit will be listed down below so you guys can check it out. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Also smash that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. I love you guys so much and I will see you next time. Bye.